All right, I'm going to take a few moments to show you how to forward your Bristol Public Schools Gmail to another email account. It's a great idea to set up if you don't want to always be checking two emails. This will send any email you get from students um, or other teachers to your uh, an email account of your choosing. And we're going to practice with forwarding it to my uh, school groupwise email. So, um, in the internet, I'm going to go to mail.bristol k12.org takes me to the Bristol Public Schools Gmail page in which I will type in my username and password and next takes us to our inbox from your inbox you want to come over here to this little gear which is um, if you mouse over it will say settings and inside of it you actually want to choose the link for settings once into the overall settings you want to come here to forwarding click on that and you want to add a forwarding address type in whichever email address you'd like to use and click next now it wants to run a little verification it'll take a moment um, and I will resume this when I get the email alright and I have received my verification email from Google um, you read through it, you can either put the code in to the website or you can click on this link here. I'm going to click on the link. Yay! Now I can forward things. I'm going to close this window. Um, you can type in the code. Um, having already done it, I've, I've already verified it, so I just click on the verify button without the code. Now, while there's an address here, it's still not um, enabled, so now you have to switch it to forward a copy and then you have to choose if you want to keep the mail in your Gmail mailbox whether you want it to be marked as read and left in the mailbox whether you want it archived, filed away, or just deleted. Um, I'm, for now I'm going to leave it here because I envision communicating with students or other faculty members through the Google account and there's more um, options there to do things like that so I'm just going to leave it set on that. You can always change it later if you change your mind. All right, and so that is all I have to do to forward it simply save it now and we're all set. If you have any questions please stop by the library and let me know. Thank you!